friends love meat, and Gram love friends. Hmm. Gram missed that. So, Gram start meat week. Together, we meet cook, we meet eat, we meet share. Humans are Gram's friends. We meet eat together. But no eat human meat. Gram is good. Gram don't do that. Harsh lighting for harsh weather. We are currently outside Flatwoods Tavern here in Flatwoods, and this is where we are going to be cooking all of our items. Now, I don't know about you, but for me, I'm so happy to know that Graham does not want to eat humans. And then I start to think about it. He is a super mutant, so amongst his super mutant community, they eat whatever they can eat. And I just picture Graham sitting there with Moo Moo, fighting off the super mutants and say no Moo Moo is my pet anyone touches this cow is going to have to die a painful death because I'll come for you at night and I'll twist your head off oh, come on Graham do you want some of this human or not no I do not want any human I used to know that human that human used to be Bob and even though Bob owed me some cabs I'm still going to say no. no. I'll go eat other things. Goodbye. I don't know. Maybe that's too dramatic. But let's go ahead and start cooking. Hey, it stopped raining. Nice. All right, let's do this. We have mo rat chunks, stinging wing fillet, wolf ribs, and yagwe ribs. All right. Let's go ahead and cook it up and see what we have. Mo rat chunks. This is what I currently have running. Okay, let's test it out. Mo rat chunks, 30 minutes, restore 1 HP, slash second strength plus 1. Next, we have stinging wing fillet. This is what I have currently running. Let's go ahead and taste the stinging wing and see what this does. Okay, now I'm starting to see something here. The sting wing fillet for 30 minutes restores 1 HP, second strength plus 2. And it looked like it replaced the mo rat chunks. Ah, that's because it gives you plus 2 instead of plus 1. All right. We have some wolf ribs. This is what I'm currently running. Let's go ahead and have some ribs. Pass the barbecue sauce and hot sauce, please. Wolf ribs for 30 minutes restores one HP slash second per plus two. Next, we have the Yagwe ribs. Go ahead and try this out. Okay, this is what I'm currently running. So let's go ahead and eat. And we have restore 1 HP slash second melee damage plus 10% for 30 minutes. what I'm currently running. Now, I'm going to go ahead and eat the items that I bought from the store. I didn't cook them. So, let's go ahead and see what they do. And this is what it looks like. Let's go ahead and try this. I think I got this from doing the event that is going on. Graham's 
Meat Week event. I have Resistance 1 HP, second max HP plus 30 for 30 minutes. Nice. We're going to try the cooked soft shell meat. This is currently what I am running. We have restore 1 HP slash second max AP plus 20. We're going to try the rad toad omelet. Yes, these are the eggs that popped off of its back. I know what you're thinking. Ew, yes, but you just need those eggs and some wood and then you can make you some omelet. This is currently what I'm running. Let's go ahead and down this. The Rad Toad Omelette is giving me Restore 1 HP slash Second N plus 1 for 30 minutes. We are going to try the Sweet Roll. looks like it's kind of glazed or something like that let's let's go ahead and try it this is currently what I'm running all right here we go the sweet roll for an hour and 30 minutes restores 3 HP second AP plus 12 CHR plus three. That's pretty good. Sweet Roll is going the distance with that hour and 30 minutes. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. Little technical difficulty. I had to get out of the game. Um, let's go ahead and get back into cooking. Now, I did notice something. I lost the hour and 30 minute food item that I was running. I came back. Everything else is running, but that item is totally gone. Now, when you are crafting any cook cookable items, you have different categories that you can choose from. You have all drinks, all food, healing, meat, plants, prepared, and utilities. Now, if you go into all drinks and hit X, it's going to give you a list of all the recipes that you have learned in Appalachia. Now, the grayed out items are only like that because over here on the right hand side where it says required it's telling me I need one wild berry to make this berry juice now for those who might be wondering well where can I find all these items that I might need you just simply go out into the forest and forge and gather some stuff and make sure you're kinda close to a cooking station because if you're overweight then you are going to go really really slow now, for other people who figure, okay, what if I don't want to just go out into the forest, walking around, searching for this stuff? Well, you can look up Wiki. They have some nice maps there to where they can show you where each and every item is located in Appalachia. Alright, so we're going to hit O, and we are going to go into All Foods, and we're going to hit X. Now, I only want to focus in on the stuff I can make, so I'm going to press in the L3 stick. And it's going to only show me items that I can cook. And what's on the menu? We have Appalachia Chili. Baked Botfly. Mmm. Corn Soup. Now, we're not going to do crispy squirrel bits because we already did that. We have Dog Meat Steak ground mo meat rat now we already did mo meat chunks so we're not going to do that one mothman egg omelet mutton chops now we already did ribeye steak we're not going to do that one silt bean puri silt bean soup we already did squirrel on a stick sweet tomato stew syrup Tasty Squirrel Stew. Mmm. So those are the items we're going to go ahead and make. Now, I would like to start from the top and then work my way down, but since we have Tasty Squirrel Stew, 
we might as well get our XP going, right? So let's go ahead and make this. It doesn't look half bad. It almost looks like pizza in a cup. Well, pizza that's kind of burnt. But, you know, that. Let's go ahead and make this. All right. It's currently what I'm running. Now, as you can see, the hour and 30 minute item that I have is totally gone because I had to log out of the game, go do something really quick, and then I, I jumped back in. It didn't take me that long, but, you know, of course, the minutes have gone down. Okay, so let's go ahead and get our XP going. Let's get us some tasty squirrel stew. And we have restore to HP slash second bonus XP plus 10%. Corn soup is gone. Okay. Let me go get some water. Sorry about that. Some of the ingredients required the boiled water. And since I already got the stew going, I lost my water. So let me go ahead and make some water. All right, there we go. All the stuff is coming back. Yay. All right. Let's go into foods. Okay, it looks about right. Okay, so I'm going to lose some of the ingredients because this right here requires four waters. So I will have to go get some water and come back, go get some water and come back. You know, I think I, I should go do that now, so I'll be right back. Okay, let's get started. Appalachia chili. Let's go ahead and make this. This is what I'm currently running. Let's take a look at the Appalachia Chili. Well, it looks like dog food. Yeah. And it's it's not coming out of the can, so yeah, it's it's looks like dog food or maybe cat food. Something like that. I, I don't know. But let's go ahead and try it. It's given me restore one HP slash second luck plus two. We're going to have some big bot fly. This is what I'm currently running. Restore one HP second rad exposure resistance plus 10. For 30 minutes. We're going to have some corn soup. Now this doesn't look too bad. I mean it is kind of greenish in there but that does not look too bad. Let's go ahead and try it. This is what I'm currently running. All right down the hatch. The corn soup for 30 minutes is restoring 1 HP, second AP, regain plus 3. Let's go ahead and have some dog meat steak. This is what I'm currently running. Alright, dog meat steak. Restore 2 HP, second in plus 3 for 30 minutes. We're going to cook up some Mothman egg omelet. This is what I'm currently running. Let's go ahead and try this. Now, the looks of it, it doesn't look that bad it almost looks like the wheel of maybe a toy truck but it doesn't look that bad let's go ahead and try it 
Mothman Egg Omelette. For 30 minutes, restore 1 HP. Second, CHR plus 2. We have some mutton chops. Let's go ahead and try this. Okay, this is currently what I'm running. Let's go ahead and taste this and see what happens. We have restore 1 HP second and plus 2 for 30 minutes. Time for some silk bean soup. Almost the same as the corn soup. Let's go ahead and try this. This is currently what I'm running. Alright. Restore 1 HP slash second in plus 2. What happened to my other... We lost an ingredient. We lost an ingredient. What? Puri. We need... Oh, I need to go get that. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. I ran out of the silt beans. I had to go get them to make the silt bean puri. So let's go ahead and try this. Now, again, I'm noticing that they are really similar. Now, why that is like way out there. It really looks like really small and then... This is kind of like a close-up. I, I don't know. I don't know. But let's go ahead and try it. Okay, this is what I'm currently running. Let's go ahead and try this. The Silt Bean Puri restores 2 HP, psychic damage resistance, plus 15. Next is syrup. Mmm, syrup. Okay, this is currently what I'm running. Let's go ahead and taste that syrup. I think we just kind of opened it up and then just drunk it down. Okay, here we go. Syrup for 30 minutes. Restore 1 HP slash second AGI plus one and I had to scroll down I thought the soup was replaced but I'm actually eating a lot and I, I forget to scroll down to see what I'm currently running I apologize about that now we're gonna go ahead and try some drinks this is lemonade and then we have simple suit flower tea Okay, so this is currently what I'm running. Let's go ahead and wash down all this food with some lemonade. Lemonade has its own separate category. I have, for 30 minutes, AP resistance plus 2, max AP plus 4. Next we have simple soot or soot flour tea. No label. I think we just find a jar and then we just kind of like put it in the jar. It's not clean jar. It looks very dirty. Now, is it dirty on the outside or the inside? Now, if it was me, the clean, it would be in a clean jar. And I'd put a label on it, but no. It's, this is Appalachia Fallout. We don't do that. Okay, this is currently what I'm running. Let's go ahead and try this. Oh, that's interesting. So the drinks are stackable. Hmm. I'm getting restore 1 HP, max AP plus 10. This is Comanche Native, and I'll see you next time. Oh, I don't know what I ate, but I'm starting to hallucinate.